think they're thirsty at all? I mean, you know, them, them nice fancy waters for cold weather would be awesome, but, you know, I guess it's not as bad with lower numbers now, but it used to be in the summer they'd come in, we'd have to turn these extra lines on and pull the three quarter inch hose from the machine shed over to keep them from sucking the tank inside out, literally. And yet, things are melting. It's raining at the moment, just little tiny. We hit like 27 last night for a little while, but five o'clock this morning it was 34. Ah, look, a little chrome trick. Yes, yes, dancer's kid. Who are you? Oh, 41, huh? Well, there's still quite a bit of ice. Let's them to walk across, but there's still solid chunks here in the lot. But it'll be mud soon enough. Birds are really active this morning, too. And yes, yes, my nose is running this morning because we... Uh, I, I enjoyed that, you know, 75-80% humidity when it was cold. And yeah, that's all the lower that got. 98% humidity this morning. 023 there, the old lady. Yeah, if they quit drinking, I'd been done filling an hour ago. Oh, well. So I wanted to thank everybody for their guesses on Moose's weight. Yeah, Got to do something once in a while, make it a little fun, right? And a few of you missed out, like Nelson, who's been apologizing up and down. I'm sorry, I missed out. I'm sorry. No. It happens. Can't, can't always hit everything. Oh, anyway, we're going to see what the day brings. It might bring rolling my balls back in my head and passing out. I don't know. Little moose. He don't look too bad today. He's getting around to where he's eating more. But poor mama there, she still hasn't cleaned yet. I got on. Oh, no. Yeah, she tried to see what might come loose. And of course, nothing's coming loose. I, it, it's funny how that can work. I mean, sometimes when you do pull them, the cotyledons don't like to break loose. But we were, or should I say Ty, was uh, working around with cotyledons that already broke loose to get the chains on. So you would think that since part of them were already broke loose, you know the rest of them would fairly soon. Oh, hell no. Oh, well, she just got packed. That's all we can do. Keep her in here. Maybe she'll finally slough it out. I tried it on it. Yep. Got Not her. really tricky if it's hanging on it, too, and it'll help with gravity and pull a little weight in that spot. If, if it's hanging to the ground, it can get broke off, and then you lose that weight that's hanging there. If you can break it off. Yeah, if it breaks. If, if you want to break it off, it won't. But if, it's, if they're dragging it around, it'll break off and usually break off too freaking high. I just cleaned it. She's smelling herself now. Oh, God. She got a little bit, looks like about from her knee down there. And well, she has a couple pockets of food. fluid. Yeah. I don't want... <laughs> yeah. Don't, <laughs> don't, don't break those pockets gag, of fluid. I mean, anybody want a real good gag gift, you know, that's something you get one of those when they've set for a couple days and put them underneath somebody's seat in the back of their car. And just don't do it to my pickup. Hey, I there's a few people I can think of I'd like to do that to, but you know, I, I, I'm, I might be a mean son of a bitch, but that doesn't mean I'm that mean. I, mean, I, I know guys that used to put Limburger cheese on a manifold or, or tuck Limburger cheese up into the heater core. 
I, I don't think I could do, the, you know, I could do the Limburger cheese thing to somebody, but I just can't do the the few day old <clears throat> afterbirth to somebody. Oh, I could easily. I normally uh, don't gag like this ever. Dad can even tell you, I'm good at this part. I literally do not gag or anything over this. Oh my Jesus! It used to be me. Yeah, you're shaking your head like, yeah, I know. It's wrong. I, I used to be able to deal with those. And, uh, you know, just as, as long as you don't take that OB glove and touch any any of your clothes or rub your nose or any of that stuff, I was fine. It's even any, on the anymore. It's even on the top. Of my well, it's yeah. Not even on the leg that I got sprayed up either. <laughs> God damn. I, in case you can't hear it, yeah, it's still dripping off the upper roof. Oh, it's been. Jesus light rain all morning. We had snow twice. Well, uh, it did snow. Light rain bullshit. It's, it snowed most of the night. It's just that it got too warm to keep snowing. I turned white from well, walking to the house to the cook shack last night. And you can see what the driveway looks like now. We're supposed to freeze um, and have snow all night tonight, she, too. She went to town last night. Mm-hmm. Yesterday. Well, it was okay. Yesterday okay. Oh, that's right. It was in the morning. <laughs> Roads were shit. Flat out shit. The county and the state need to learn how the fuck to plow. I, I, Maury hasn't had a truck turn a wheel in a few days because it, it, it just ain't worth trying to go out there, you know. Too many idiots blocking the roads. And, well, he's been taking his mom to work, too. Yeah, taking his mom to work so she didn't have to drive. They finally got smart yesterday and actually closed, the state closed a couple of roads so that they could get tow trucks in to clear the road. So they could actually get through and get snow plows and, and the sanders right, through. She's getting this stuff off her boot now. Well, she don't plug up the ditch up here. Yeah, the almighty ice flow. I broke some up earlier so it'll keep going down there instead of coming in here. I had a big chunk about this big. Anyway, that's damn near five minutes here. So if we had smell of vision, y'all could enjoy it. How did I get on my sweatshirt? Two <laughs> gloves and a freaking jacket. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Okay. Okay, there you go. The older she gets, the more she notices it. Well, <laughs> you know, I'm the token daughter that does this, and I do a damn good job at it. But shit! <coughs> and how the f how do I get on my hat? My head wasn't even anywhere near her freaking vagina. Jesus Christ, me! Yeah. Oh my god. That's some good stuff in here. Girl! I mean, I she was gonna be outside for a week. I don't smell too much of it from here, but Girl, I can tell mama. it's there. When you do it, you do it. Now that it's been disturbed, if you get closer to her, you really notice it. And obviously she got disturbed. <laughs> I think that's funny. Now she knows how I feel when I don't get too close to it. I say it didn't used to bother me. Uh, she says the rain's a little chunky, so it's supposed to be that way all freaking day. Like for the next week, we're supposed to get snow and then get a little warmer during the day and then get snow and get warmer. And just enough to... Yeah, I'm glad we're not even out of the driveway much. When we used to move a lot of grain out of here, and we used to fill all four of those bins and then haul it out all winter. And man, there were some winters that we were putting some good ruts in the driveway because it would do this. If you didn't get, oh, excuse me, if you didn't get out of here first thing in the morning, the ruts were in the driveway for a while. And the last, when I was still hauling into town, I'd, I'd make sure I got in here and got loaded up at night so I could get out of here in the morning on the freeze. The empty truck doesn't leave too big of ruts, but a loaded truck even as hard packed as this driveway is, and it's like it is right now. I mean, walking across it, I'm sinking in a half an inch. Take a loaded truck, and they really sink. So, anyway, and now that's damn near seven minutes just talking about something that stinks. Yay, the end of another day. It has snowed, it has rained, it has done everything today. Temperatures dropped down to like 33 degrees earlier. And Snowed like hell for a while, then warmed back up. And yeah, it's leaving. And, yeah, I meant to have Ty check the temperature on Moose's mama this morning. She got it done after lunch. 
she'd be a sick girl, 104 degree temp. So, we done what we can for her for now. I knew I should have checked her yesterday. I just had that feeling. That happens. Have the feeling and forget about it. And, or, you know, I think I did say something to tell you yesterday, but by then she was, she was done for the day, for the most part. And yeah, it's still dripping everywhere. This is like one of the few times it hasn't been either a fine mist because it started as snow and melted on the way down or or it was chunks the size of the end of my thumb coming down. But most of the driveway is clear and good on its own. Sun's going down. Cows are in the barn eating hay. My day is done. So, hope you all had a had a good Sunday and hope everybody has a great week coming up.